Hey guys, so today I released MCPE Texture Pack Installer to the Google Play Store for you guys to get and to install texture packs on MCPE 0.11.0 and 0.11.1. So when I released it this morning, only 0.11.0 was out, and by the time I got home, 0.11.1 was already released. That was extremely frustrating for me, and I already went over it in a different video, so I'm not going to even go over it here. But I have updated MCPE Texture Pack Installer to support 0.11.1. So if you have not received that update again, or update yet, uh, check again and also open the app and it should uh, prompt you to update to the latest version because that does support 0.11.1. Anyways, I'm going to be showing you how this works. And I also want to answer a question that some people have been asking. And they're asking, why is MCPE Mod Locator and MCPE Texture Pack Installer two separate apps or why are they i think i said why is i don't remember anyways uh the reason is i'm going to open up mcpe texture pack installer here and i just reinstalled it so it's going to go through the first time process but i can explain right now anyways so if you look at in the main page here it has four different options install texture pack revert to default quick switch and how to use if i tried to cram all of those into mcpe mod locator it would just be a mess for a lot of people because MCPE Mod Locator, when it comes to mods and textures, is just downloading them, downloading them. And in previous updates, you know, it's you know installed texture packs using Block Launcher, but now is going to be using this, and still uses Block Launcher for mods. So, if having all of these different options and stuff crammed in MCPE Mod Locator, it would it would just be annoying for some people, especially if they don't want to use mod or texture packs. Jeez. Uh, if they don't want to use texture packs, it could be annoying for them. So another thing is, is if somebody doesn't want to use MCPE Mod Locator, then they can just download this and then install texture packs from a file on their device. If they just downloaded something from the internet and wanted to install it, they could use that install texture pack feature up there at the top. So they wouldn't even need MCPE Mod Locator if they don't want it. That's why I'm doing it this way. It's just, it's simpler for most people and it works, you know, if I'll show you how it works with MCPE tech or MCPE mod locator and how they work together very well. Um, and also if you, if you don't have MCPE texture pack installer, you can still use MCPE mod locator, not the 0 0.11.0 texture pack section, which I will show you. And it's also not in the current update, but, uh, this is just my version that I've been testing for a while. See, if I open it up here, there's no problems. You know, there's nothing, it's not saying, you know, uh, you need MCPE texture pack installer or this that and the other thing whatever it's not doing that if I go here still nothing 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 servers maps nothing but if I go to textures 0 0.11.0 textures which again is not in the current update it's just in uh, my version right now then it says missing application and then it tells you that you need MCPE texture pack installer hit get it now open it up install accept and we're good to go. It's going to start downloading it, installing it. And then we can go back to MCPE Mod Locator and we are good to go. So let's go ahead and let's try Majora's Mask Craft, even though I don't think this one even works. We'll give it a shot though. Installing texture pack, please wait. Oh, Candy Crush. God, gross. I hate Candy Crush. Yeah, that didn't work. Problem parsing package, close. Let's try Universe Craft. I think I used this one before, and I think it was pretty cool. Also, I will be showing you the quick switch feature because you're probably like, wow, sitting here and waiting for it to install kind of sucks. Although it is going slower than it should be because my tablet has just kind of gone to hell in a handbasket in the past few, I don't know, months. So, anyways, uninstall, hit uninstall, hit install. And that is the texture pack. It's been added and it's ready to go. 
but you can see in the background a little dialog window popped up so you can open mcpe directly from here i'm gonna hit done and it says your texture pack installed successfully would you like to add this to your quick switch list quick switch is a part of mcpe texture pack installer and makes switching between texture packs very fast select yes to add it now let's go ahead and click yes so I'd shown this off before because if I go into MCPE Texture Pack Installer, which is doing my first time setup again for some reason, you can see here it says universecraft.quickswitch. Well, more to it than that. It also tells you what version it's for as well. So click it and you can either delete it or install it. I'm going to go ahead and install it and you can see it immediately pops up and says it's ready to go. Also what I added, which I think is going to be very helpful for some people who don't even understand the quick switch feature, although it is very easy, or just don't want to open up MCPE Texture Pack installers, if they go back and try to download the same texture pack that they just got through MCPE Mod Locator, it'll pop up and say, hey, this is in your quick switch list. So you can hit install, and immediately again, it pops up just like that. That makes it a lot quicker, because then you don't even need to open up, oh, <laughs> clicked my own ad, whoops. Um, you don't even need to open up MCPE Texture Pack Installer, and if you completely forgot that you even, you know, used the quick switch thing, it'll be there right away so that you can get it, and I think that makes things quite a bit easier for people. So, yeah, so let's go ahead and open it and see what Universe Craft looks like. There we go. I like that little background. Let's see. Well, I'm lagging pretty hard. Well, at least I'm getting input lag. The actual frame rate's not terrible, but this is a cool texture pack. Although that sun is just... That looks... Gay. Ugh, I don't like that. Let's just look the other way. Anyways. I like this texture pack. This is pretty cool. Let's go look at the water. It looks like it's actually moving. Let's see. Oh, yeah, they got the wavy water. I love that one. That's... When they have the shaders mod or whatever, the texture packs that have the wavy, waving water, that is the coolest. I think that's really awesome. I wonder if boats respond to it. I always forget where all this crap is. Where, where am I going here? Boats, right there. Let's see if the boat moves with it. Oh, I don't think it does. Let's see. No, it doesn't. Oh well, still a cool texture pack nonetheless. You can see MCPE Texture Pack Installer does work very well with uh, MCPE Mod Locator. So now I'm going to show you the default textures option again in uh, MCPE Mod Locator. Well, I've, I showed you that in MCPE Texture Pack Installer there's an option for that right on the main menu. But, let's close all my crap out. If you go here, here, there is an option for default textures, so just click that. It'll ask you if you actually want to go ahead and do this. Hit yes. Give it a second, and it's signing the zip file it needs. Although on my tablet, again, it's going mega slow because it sucks. Oops. Install. And we are good. And give it a second. All right, we're good. And you can see we are back to the boring old awesome looking default textures. No more waving water, sadly. Wait. It is waving. Although not nearly as much, so that's probably why I haven't noticed it, but okay, it's still it's moving. Again, not very much, but it's there. Anyways, so I guess I can show you the quick switch feature and how it actually works. So let's go back to Universe Craft, download, or to show you that it actually does work. I showed you how it works, but show you that it does work. Hit install, hit OK. That, of course, pops up again. open and bam we are back to universe craft <laughs> I just noticed pedo bear at the bottom <laughs> that's, 
the most random thing. And some people are probably gonna get mad and say it's pedo bear, but I think pedo bear sounds funny. Pedo bear <laughs> seal of approval. That is awesome. Sort of. It's funny. Oh, that makes me sound weird when I say it's awesome, but I just think it's hilarious. <laughs> pedo bear. <laughs> that is just weird. Are those two kissing in the background? No, it looks like they're just hugging. Okay. And what's going on with that Enderman and the dude back there? That just looks really wrong. I think a pervert made this texture pack. <laughs> That's funny. Wow. Just close out of that, I guess. Wow. So anyways, that is MCPE Texture Pack Installer. Like I said, if you want to get it, there is a link in the description. And if you also want to get MCPE Mod Locator, if you don't have it already, there is a link in the description for that as well. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Leave your comments down below. What do you think of MCPE Texture Pack Installer? I'm looking forward to reading all of your comments. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.